And let's install the new one. E That's not good, ladies and gents. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are doing some mirror stuff. Carbon fiber mirror cap replacement on the S5. I believe this works for the A5, A4, S5, S4, RS5. We are replacing these because, uh, well, just look at that. We are already kind of in motion on the other side. We wanted to kind of get it down before I did the filming aspect, but this is gonna be the tutorial. So if you guys are new to the channel, want to see more Audi content, stuff like this, the S5 build, make sure to subscribe. If you want to help the algorithm, hit like. But without further ado, let's get into it. First thing is first, hex lights. Second thing, we're going to be taking out the mirror, which is actually quite easy. So let's just do that. So on the mirror, let's push to one side. Ugh. And then, boom, just like that. So one side's out, we'll wiggle the other side out, and then we'll have to disconnect a couple guys right here. With the uh, help of my beautiful assistant, Rory, we'll be taking off those guys. Wow, just barehanding it, like an animal. Oh yeah, oh careful, yeah. Careful, careful, we don't want that black part to come off. I did it with pliers earlier. If you're doing this at home, make sure to have a certified mechanic professional friend with you. Whoever's mechanically certified and, and is a good acquaintance of yours, it's not a bad idea to have them around. So now we just need to disconnect this little guy right here. Uh, this one's easy to believe, you just need to push down and pull out. So let's do that. Sorry. All good, thank you very much. Boom. So now we got this guy disconnected. We can go put it somewhere safe. That looks like a safe spot. Now that we have that out, we are gonna be looking at some screws. These are gonna require a little tiny Phillips head and some T9s. So a T9, if you guys are unfamiliar or not mechanically inclined, uh, looks like this. T is the torque, so we got these little torque screws. Um, this head is a size nine, so 10? 10. 10. T10. T10, T10, T9, they'll probably both work to be honest with you. <laughs> I'm gonna take a quick screen grab and just circle what we need to take out. All right, now that we've done that, let's start. So what I'm actually gonna do, and this might work on your car or you might just break off your entire mirror, um, I'm gonna move it that way. And then we have a nice angle of attack from the outside. That's one, two. I don't know what that means. It's, it's not in there at all, really. Three. That's what that means. That's not good, ladies and gents. Now we got a little more light. We got Rory's headlamp dealio on. Speaking of, all, ah, ah. all right, we got him out. So we got this little center one. Woohoo! All right, so let's let this dangle. And then what we need to do is take out this guy right here. Right there. Wrenching in the shop, wrenching in the shop. Yeah, yeah. So now that we've got everything out, we are ready to attack this thing with the trim tool. This is a fun part because it sounds and feels like you'll be breaking the car. Don't break the car. It's very important that we try our best not to break not anything. To break the car. Here we go. All right. So that piece comes off. Nicely done. Nope. Don't chuck it. So now that we have the bottom piece off, what we need to do is get these two little pinpoint areas uh, pressed down on. Oh, this one was not put in correctly. Oh, well, that's good. Oh, no, it wasn't. So obviously this was done before uh, because these are old carbon fiber ones. They were actually on the car when I bought it four years ago. Ooh. So, sounds like we're... Ooh. <laughs> that's we have not ourselves that's a, not good. <laughs> we have ourselves a greasy one. The other thing to be very careful with is this light down here. This is the turn signal indicator. It is still connected and you don't want it to break. 
Very nice. We want to take care of our old parts. Um, what we can do is either resell this for somebody to repurpose it themselves. Um, what I choose to do is just kind of yeet it. That way it's out of my life forever. And let's install the new one. Held up pretty good. So this is the new one, obviously blemish free. I PPF this myself um, with the help of Rory yesterday. So you can see there's a tiny, tiny little line, but it's barely visible in only the right lighting. So this is gonna go on the car. It's gonna be the new thing. It's gonna look amazing. And let's just get to the installation. Looks super cool under the hex lights too. First things first, let's get this put back together. So basically we're doing everything we just did in the opposite order. So once everything's in, we are just screwing in in the same order reverse that we unscrewed. The TV Unfortunately, when you let the monkeys wrench on your car, they get grease everywhere. Like this nice little grease stain right in front of Rory's reflection. Oh just greasy. Grease. Such a crybaby. Grease. Right. Should just all be clips. Some good clip clipperoonies. Mm. Does it go behind them? Yes, that goes oh, under like yeah. that first. Very nice. But it's kind of an awkward, uh, cause this needs to go under that. This and that. This and that and that and this, huh? Mm-hmm. Should I just leave you to it? <sighs> I'm gonna go head over to the other shop for a second and see what's going on and then maybe check back on cars and see where we're at. All right, she's on and she's looking decent. Paint, on the other hand, has got a bunch of grease all over it from Carson's greasy forearms, but that can be dealt with later on. All right, we're all connected. Let's pop this boy back into place. Yeah, baby. Right side turn signal. Right side is lighting up. And ladies and gents, we have done it. I say we sparingly, as it was mostly Rory and Carson, who knocked this out of the park like a couple of absolute beasts. Adjust the mirror, things are fine, fitment's great. Just gotta wipe it off and we'll be nice and done. But that's how you do it. If this video is helpful, you guys, if you learned something new, you wanna see other stuff, more modifications on the S5, more shop stuff, shenanigans, hit subscribe, stay a while. Like the video for the algorithm. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen, we'll see ya.